Hello my fellow creators, who wouldn't want a mangoes or Indian mangoes? These tropical fruits is so tempting not to try for me to paint. This is very easy process and the reference is from pixabay.com. I decided to add up some green leaves for perfect composition. You will see in my process video that controlling watercolor doesn't apply with my brush stroke this time. We all know that the watercolor has a reputation of unpredictable and being unforgiving. It is true that it can be very difficult to correct mistakes with watercolor especially when you're doing the a detailed painting but sometimes I just go with the flow and let the paints do their own things just like what happened when I'm painting these mangoes so you will see that I have too much water do I use the wet and wet techniques but it doesn't really matter because I know in the end result it will be okay with my color mixing In some point, I was concerned with this paint, the watercolor confection by Prima Marketing, the classic, because it tends to become muddy at some mixing. However, the result of these happy accidents are often breathtaking because what I would like to project with this mango painting is the kind of really ripen so this mango you can see with the color of the greenish yellow and reddish yellow that this is ready to eat you can tell also that it looks very sweet juicy and and super yummy the materials that I use here is my um, watercolor Fabriano. This is 25% cotton and 140 pounds also and the size is 9 by 12. So the difference between the Fabriano and the Arch watercolor paper is that this is 25% cotton and the arch is 100% cotton so there's a big difference between the two and the brushes that I use here is my Raphael Petit Grease Pour the size is zero and the triple zero and for my sketching I use my favorite Castell watercolor pencil I like to use this for sketching because the water blends with these colors so enjoy my process painting and see how the watercolor can be very unforgiving and unpredictable medium but there's always a happy ending right so thanks everyone, see you again on my next video. And don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button. Bye!